Well, um, when the crisis starts to ease in April, May, I was looking around me and I saw the cost, not just the financial cost to the exchequer, but the huge cost to the people of Ireland who were losing their jobs. The young people whose lives were drastically impaired, quality of life was seriously reduced, I would have thought. And I was just aware of all these things and I started looking at the risk benefit of the whole exercise. And to me, it didn't weigh up at all. Therefore, I, I consider the measures draconian because they're having a profound ill effect on society. And Martin, you spoke about this publicly in the Irish Times, but you resigned very quickly afterwards. Why was that? I'll put this very sh- briefly and succinct here, if you don't mind. I didn't have a choice. Really? Yeah. Is Ireland currently a cold house for people, do you believe, in the medical fraternity with divergent views on how we're managing COVID? Um, I'm not sure it's hard to gauge the the mood. From the start, we all thought this was absolutely correct. And I believe that. Absolutely. And when you engage and set off on a path, it's extraordinarily difficult to change that path. And the medical fraternity, it's very hard for them to come out and say what I said. Because there is the risk if you adopt a different strategy, things could possibly get worse. And I don't think any of us want that. Tell me this, if you were in charge, Martin, you, you, you've donkey's years of experience behind you in healthcare provision. But if you were in charge of NEFIT or if you were in charge of government strategy, what would you do? Can I say a little bit about NEFIT? I would be perceived as very critical of NEFIT. If NEFIT is and acts as a public health care doctor forum and their brief is to reduce disease in society, the community. But they seem to have adopted the brief that all they have to do is limit and restrict the incidence of COVID in the community with complete absence of any consideration for other diseases. And the other diseases are in difficulty, not being treated. So you're talking about the misdiagnosis of cancer, yeah, those types of things. Thing. Health is the presence of complete physical, mental and social well-being, not just the absence of physical disease or frailty. 